Triller August 3rd event at Madison Square Garden. We're talking Chris Algieri versus Mikel Lespierre. Now this is a fight for you. Both of them have extremely impressive records. Both of them have been on the big stage under the big lights multiple times. So we're gonna break some stuff down and maybe have some picks of how this fight's gonna end. So stay tuned. last year and he's been on a tear beating everybody until his last three fights he's lost two of those last three fights now still competitive a very game athlete a game fighter we're gonna see I, I believe he'll probably want to push the fight a little bit more than Chris come in a little bit maybe more front foot heavy and try to push the action and we're gonna see how that's gonna work out for him but our I gotta admit, Chris is my boy, I love that guy. So Algeria, I can see him being back foot heavy, boom, set stuff up, set the traps. Now, with this fight, I can see it possibly going in the later rounds. My two things, Chris is either going to stop Mikel, maybe say like round eight, round nine, and if that's not the case, it's gonna go to decision, but Chris will end up winning the decision. Now, if it's something earlier than that, like I'm saying, Mikel's gonna be front foot heavy, trying to push the fight. But I know, even though Chris has had an extended time off from competing, that he's been training. The guy never stops training. Every day he's in the gym. There's no joke to that. He's doing road work, bag work, mitt work, sparring, the whole thing. The guy doesn't give it up. So just because he hasn't been in the ring, that reading rust, in my opinion, in this fight, is going to, it's not going to make a, a difference for Chris. He's still been putting in the work. So this is going to be a fight you're going to want to watch. And I'm definitely putting my money on Chris. Later rounds, Possibly take him out like maybe eight, nine, or for sure winning by decision uh, if, it, if it does go that far. But that's my decision on that. That's my pick on that fight. Now, if you haven't watched the true boxer, like angles, traps, head movement, like the whole thing, like how a boxer should be, I suggest you watch this fight with Triller on August 3rd, Madison Square Garden, because it's going to be an exceptional fight. You have two of these guys that's from the same area uh, back in New York. Um, you're gonna leave it all in the ring. You're not gonna one-sided fight by any means. They're both gonna come in there, both showing up to fight. Because whoever wins this fight is going to be able to take it higher than, um, again, Chris is my boy, I love that guy. He's a true sportsman, he's a true boxer, and he wants it more. So, like, I can see him winning this fight and getting some other big fights coming on, getting so some trajectory going on, possibly for another belt fight, another title fight. Hopefully, you know, we'll be able to play this. Uh, I'll show a recap video of the fight after this. Hopefully, I'm not eating my words, but even if I did, I'm still a Chris Algieri fan. He's going to win this fight. So, if you're going to bet on this one, bet on Algieri. So, if you have questions, if you have comments, if you have stories from Chris Algieri, please put them in the comments below. And you know, maybe we can make a video about that. But, for right now, if you didn't know, and besides, I, I like it. Just again, I can't say this enough. Chris is a true sportsman, a true boxer, just a good guy. So for right now, if you didn't know, now you know. So which video do you wanna watch? You wanna watch that video? You wanna watch that video? You know, that one's really good. But on the other hand, that one helps the video you just saw.